University Arena, Albuquerque. National semifinal game, Louisville, Houston in the second half. Houston has outscored Louisville 7 to nothing to take a two-point lead. Yeah, Mishaw came out and got that ball against the pressure. Reed Geddes brings it out to Mishaw. Tipped out, everybody was in the air for that rebound. Drexler comes up with it. Michael Young, they respect that corner shot of his. He's got Rodney McCray on him. Then he comes on to make sure Young doesn't go ahead and get out of the box here. 17, 17 left in the game. Akeem brings it out to get us. Notice how Akeem is being very patient in there, not taking back. Oh, it's blocked by Scooter. He pulled it off. It's deflected by Drexler. Here comes Lancaster Gordon. Rodney McCray, the brothers did it that time. Denny Crump called a wide timeout there, slowed that momentum down, got his team reorganized. First points of the second half now for the Cardinals. Oh, intercepted by Mill Wagner. You won't see Dennis do that often. 43 all. Rodney again. McCray scores his second consecutive basket. And he's coming into this game. He had only three points in the first half. for Houston there. So that 7-0 run now is into Misha scores. How about the basket? It's going to be a charge. No, they waved the basket off. Misha instead has picked up his fourth personal. That really hurts Houston. We'll see the pass going on the inside. Excellent backdoor cut. Misha goes up. He did make contact before he released the shot. Excellent call. And again, his fourth foul. And again, the basket did not count. His teammates now trailing by two with 16-20 to play. Misha has fouled out of two games so far this year. But he got in foul trouble in one of his Midwest Regional games. Played with four fouls for a long time. Well, it helps to have a key behind him. He doesn't have to play that real tight defense, but even if his man drives by, he's got the shot blocked behind him. Wagner gets it. Milt Wagner with 18. Now a four-point lead. And the press is really pulled up now. And Louisville dropping it back. And I think sometimes they play it like an accordion, just to let you think he's got an open. Young handling the ball so well. Franklin, they're going to let him shoot it. Hakeem and Jones, and it's off of Jones. Team that time. Did you see that, Billy, how well he timed these jumps? He certainly did, Garen. The other thing he did well is not commit by going over the back and committing a foul. And that's a guy that's played basketball for four years. Here comes Geddes in, inbound. Franklin sitting down so they can inbound it. Here's Young. In a one game, great release on that jumper. Remember, this fella has had some great second half, scoring over 20 points in a number of games. He has eight points in this one. Since that timeout that Denny Crum called, Louisville has outscored Houston 6-2. to two. Scooter. That'll count. But no, let's see. They're going to call charging. They will count the basket. Nice piece of officiating. One official looking to the other and saying, did the basket go? Hank Nichols is the guy calling it. Basket counts. The foul on Scooter McRae is his third. Here comes the drive by Scooter coming across the lane, showing how well he uses the left hand. Puts it up, the ball released, then he makes the commitment. Gets, he commits the foul. The team can't touch the ball. Basket counts, foul the other way. Four point lead now. For Louisville, there's a foul on Rodney. Rodney McRae, that's only his first. He never seems to ever get into real foul trouble, you know what? A very smart player. Made the Olympic team in 1980. 16 fouls now against Louisville. Clyde Drexler coming back in. Mishaw will sit down. Franklin's in and Geddes sets down. There's Mishaw playing with four personals. Geddes, the inbound specialist. Brings him in on the Young side. wide open. What's happening on that? Well, the team is blocking out Jones on the side. He can't get out there to get him. Team almost picked up a foul there. It's off of the team. Louisville with the four-point lead and the basketball. That timeout, he's got to go back to it. Then he comes really slowed down the momentum. Houston now has missed their last four shots. Oh, good defense. Joe Wagner, Akeem got hung up in the air that time. He's going to be all right. He hits the deck. Here comes John. Oh, boy. He lost the ball. All by himself, a scooter. It's just a mental mistake by Houston. You can't afford to take off and let a man wide open there. They had five on four the other way. Biggest lead of the game now for Louisville. Rejected by Jury and Benny Anders saves it. Here we go to the other end now. Bill Wagner. And we have a foul on Anders. That was that same man that dunked on the other end. Came 90 feet.
He's almost made a steal. And their second foul, third team foul against Houston. Denny, Denny's wondering what happened, but it is a foul on Houston. I tell you, if you take your eyes off of this court, they're up and down the floor four times. That's how quickly this game is going. 51 47, Louisville. Wagner, beautiful to Jones, he's fouled. He's going to be young. Beautiful dish by Wagner right there. Goes right into the middle of the lane. We'll see it inside. Here's Schooner going up, making the block. Andrews makes the dunk. And then we go the other way. Good lead pass. Houston has their back turned to the ball. Got a good move defensively, and the ball came the other way. That foul on Young, he's first. Team fouls now, four. And Mishaw back in the game with the four fouls on him. Jones with a lot of lot in this game. He has ten points. Looks like he's breathing a little bit better than he was in the it, first half. He's four or five from the line. It seems like all the players have adjusted much better. It might have been an anxiety level, too, that they all had in that first half. Hyperventilated look. And it's the 37, and there's going to be a foul. That's going to be on Rodney reaching in. That's the seventh team foul. So they'll be shooting free throws. It's awful early to be in that kind of situation. We're going to go down the other end. You got 14 18 to go on the clock and being in one and one this early, but Houston not a good free throw shooting team So they not they might not be able to take advantage with what should be a very critical situation at the 14 18 mark now this team for the year shooting 62 percent Michael Young let's check him for the year 66. That's one of the higher ones. He has eight points in this game three rebounds Michael Young should be a much better free throw shooter because he does have the good release on his jump shot. Misha almost was able to follow. Boy, Scooter's really playing well in the last two to three minutes. He was the guy that beat Arkansas, you might recall, that last second tip in the Mideast Regional. Jones open. There's a good pass inside. That's over everybody and in. Scooter McRae with eight points. Boy, they turned this around now. Now the McRae brothers from Mount Vernon, just like the Williams brothers, playing very well. 55-47, Houston needed that one. Alvin Franklin, six-point lead now for Louisville. Wagner's been a little quieter in the second half. Franklin's really doing the job hounding him. Well, eight of 14 in that first half. Loses the ball, here comes Drexler, look out. Pass to Misha, I don't know how he caught it. The basket will not count, he's called for charging, he's fouled out of the way. Ball game. Well, he's really upset, too. It was a tough pass for him to have to handle, Gary. You made an excellent point. And here's the steal down there. Drexler got a piece. Now, he's coming. Now, if you're Mishaw, you really don't want this pass. Because when it was thrown to him, he made a tough catch. And then he has to go right into the middle to commit the charge. So, Mishaw fouls out with eight points at the 13-28 mark. And mark up on that scoreboard. Houston down six when he goes out. Now, wait a minute. Mishaw's not leaving the floor yet. He does yep. have five. Guy Lewis is going to be sure, I think, before he gets him out. Remember well, the game last week? Well, this guy Drexler that. fouled out with six. They gave him an extra foul. Well, they played like NBA players. Maybe they thought it was NBA rules. So Mishaw will leave. Vinny Anders will come in. Now, you got to remember, Misha is the senior, the only senior in the starting lineup, and he doesn't want his career to end now, and he has no way now of having an effect on that one way or another. A lot of time left in this one. Six-point lead for the Cardinals. Backdoor Jones, he's fouled. Houston right up there in the air with him. 16 foul. Second foul on Michael Young. Timeout now, Guy Lewis. Houston with 13-18 left in the game. Trailing by six points after starting out the second half. 7 0. 13-18 to go. Louisville after being outscored early. 7 0. And trailing by two. After